Hey everybody, my name is Tektos and this is Let's Play Old World. We're back with Harmheb the Keystone and uh, there's nothing else to do in the turn so we'll just uh, end it and let the AI do its thing. And I actually want to watch a little bit what Babylon is doing over here because it... Excuse me? It's currently another team's turn. Okay, so now, huh, that's weird. I hope I didn't queue up a uh, turn end now and uh Hello? What's happening? Okay, now is Assyria. Not weird. Normally you just see that what they do, but like the thinking phases one through twenty or something, but apparently this time no. Okay. Greece also declares war on Assyria. That is not great. Um, news have arrived that King Hamilcar the Just of Carthage is dead. And uh, they also like us. Not as much as Hamilcar, but enough. We have now improved our standing with Menaikism. Uh, plus 40, nice. Okay, so we're uh, slowly working our way up there. The Rastrianism, at least they don't hate us. Mm, and they also don't hate us. Okay. <clears throat> right, so let's get to it. Um, this is not great, because Greece... Let's actually see, but they're all probably just similar in strength, if you hover over here. Um, yes, they're similar in power. Greece is similar in power. Similar and similar. Um, and Greece does have a big military, though they have to move it first, so... There's some time for Assyria. Oh, man, they really have it rough. It makes sense from Greece perspective because Carthage is I think even stronger. But um, hopefully they'll backstab. That, that would be perfect. Either way these guys bashing each other's head in is uh, is perfect for us. A delegation from a distant kingdom has arrived. As a mark of respect they offer us a choice of exotic creature exotic creature uh, to add to our royal menagerie. Which should we choose? Uh, monkeys fish oh it's full enough we had a monkey already so i'm gonna pick a fish this time let's see what that can do probably just but uh, hey promote governor menakuri the younger is a relative uh, he is 55 diplomat pious superstitious uh, it make him prosperous good extra money affable Extra growth. Yes, please. That is perfect, because we could use that growth in here desperately. We have a lot of uh, civics output, but we have no way of um, actually doing anything in terms of specialists, because we don't have uh, citizens. Right, so here we have the fisher completed now. Um, we could build another fishing ground there. Next worker to finish is going to do that. And we have one specialist available. Um, so I want to get scribes, I think. <clears throat> we have enough fishers. We're already in strong culture. Um, it's going to take us a while. But I want to get scribes first and then poets, artists, uh, and the like. So we'll start with the apprentice here. Blah, blah, blah. Well, we can buy out stuff. What would you? Plus 12 unrest. Yeah, we'll buy out the next one. Okay, we have one idle scout, but let's first get through the workers. Oh, a new settler in chem. Perfect. Uh, you, sir, will go over here. And uh, do we encroach on 
Assyria. Let's see. We could go here. Um, I certainly want that barley field. Whatever else we do. Hmm. So it's either or. That should be no problem. If we settle here, we then get the fish, which should enable the horses, which should enable the crabs. Something along those lines. So let's move it here. If we actually invested a force march, why not? Yes. And then we're gonna found a Saiti city, I'm pretty sure. Um yes, why not? They have five, 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 six for Tutmosid, so we'll get another Saiti. This is the royal family after all, I mean they should have the most. Right, we have you here. Um just chill out for now. And as usual, we'll go in here with the forum and the walls. Okay. Good, so one more settler needed. And that is coming to my knowledge in Yes, in Vasset. Okay. So we got them all. Cool. And then we're pretty much through with the settling. Um, then we just need to build up the culture and hope that Greece loses a couple points in trying to bash on Assyria. Because it's pretty hard to fight in that forest of onagers there. Right, so now we'll uh, go for the amphitheater here. Actually, let's see. Library. There's a couple of nice spots for it. Hmm, how about we get that here first? I don't really need the culture currently. <coughs> ah, hang on. Um, move you back. Come on. How about we get the library? Um, somewhere here was a nice library spot. So we'll go there. No, okay, we're gonna build it on the mountain. Yep, we're gonna build it there on the mountain. Okay, I was just thinking, um, but it's not worth it to build it next to the uh, city center and give up the potential wonder slot. So, that was my thought process there. Cool, and now we can build the amphitheater here. And honestly, why not? I mean, that's why we built this line here like this. And we got a bit of catching up to do, culture-wise, so... Because Jado is just strong now. Yeah. So why not catch up properly? And here, oh, where to start? Probably with the nets. Yeah, we have a lot of them around here. So that city is going to grow rapidly, but it's a quick thing to get, um, and it's also a resource we could spare. Okay, so we have this and that, and uh, I guess we'll go over here and help out with the... Uh, could we have reached that barley field? Yes, we could have, so that seems better. Got that farm. Get the growth going <clears throat> as soon as possible so we can build some specialists. And uh, yeah, two more workers. Here we have the barracks, we have the range, we have the garrison, and we can now get this. Mm -hmm. Right, Tamiad has all that good stuff. Um, we could get the academy here. Just buy a bit of stone. Honestly, why not get an academy? We could use some extra science output. This seems like a good spot. Ah, no, 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 no. Hang on. Tamiat was the one that 
doesn't have too many civic points, right? Yes, so we'll go with the ministry. Mm, where is it? Ministry, ministry, there you are. Mm -hmm. What's more important? Oops, no, no, no. That was. Uh... Oh, we are through the workers already, okay. Oh, we only have 10 orders, man. Sorry, I, uh, I got confused here. Right, um, we could unlimber here on the mountain, and we do. Archer, you can just. Uh, actually, we'll upgrade you, and then we can just hang out here, um, if you don't mind. And we'll upgrade. Ah, if I could only click him. I'll play these dudes as well. Alright. Uh, Basset Archer. Why did I move you? Um, we do have a Basset Archer. Here's defense. We have an Axeman here and here. We could use a Basset defense down here. Doesn't have to be an Archer though, but currently we don't have another unit, so Archer it is. Oh, hang on. My... Um, wasn't there another... We had a chariot somewhere running around here. Where's my chariot? And we have the Camel Archer. They're also all utterly useless here. So we can just bring, yeah, we'll bring the archer to the front lines. Maybe just hang out here. And we'll bring this Axeman. If I could just click it, I mean, sometimes the game, okay, there we go. Bring this Axeman down toward here. Okay. Mm, yeah, we have one more Scout move available, but I'll just try and go through Carthage into Greece again. Try and get some um, some scouting information there. Some networks built. All right, quick turn. So we have now almost settled all the land, and we have one more, and that's going to bring us up to fifty-one points. Ah, fifty-three points rather. And then we need 11 more to have double the amount of Greece. And that, I think, is a win condition. Or we discover Barding. That's going to give us an ambition. But controlling six legendary cities, I mean, it is a ridiculous task in one... In one lifetime. Um, we... Babylonia is now a truce. Oh man, so that means they're gonna move their whole ant swarm back into their little land there. But whatever. Um, we have some conversions. We got 180 research. Oh, we were exposed though, so they get minus 40, but that's okay. Um, we influence Greece. Very nice. Right, so we need um, barding or infantry. We should be able to get... Oh, we need the Marshal Code first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I forgot about that. So, yeah, we'll get the Marshal Code. Um, pilgrimage. Plus five. Not really. Random promotion. All cities plus one random promotion for any units. Okay, that is good. State religion cities can hurry units with money. That's also good. Hmm, but both I don't really need. Uh, let me get that better upgrade from moat. But I also don't need that. But we need the follow-up. We need the uh, the infantries, uh, the barding. So, yeah, it is what it is. Okay, um, two workers only this time. Uh, we have the barracks. Hamlets, Garrison Range, 
could build an academy here. Could do that. Um, I'm not sure of Nate, not really. We get 0.5 orders. I mean, it's nice to have, but plus 10 signs is very, very tempting. Is there another spot like this? Plus 9 up here. And that's where we want to build the culture. Oh, no, we don't. We have the amphitheater already. And plus 8, of course, in the city, which is also not bad, but I think here it doesn't bother anyone. Unless... Yeah, unless we wanna, okay, we'll build it here. We'll lose out on one, but here's a spot where we can build another um, range or barracks or something. Okay, um, we have now built a citadel. We could get some extra growth. And in this here, I think it does matter. Yes, it does, because we're out of citizens already. And that's it for the workers already. Um, we'll move... Well, scouts are not that important. Let's, uh, let's do everything else first. Now, we have completed the farmer. And if we get you... Ah, the rancher doesn't do much. Yeah, that wasn't what I was hoping for. I mean, we'll get extra growth. 14. But do we really need it? Do we really need it? Or are we better off with the Acolyte here? Darn it, I was hoping we could expand up here. So we have to build something there and try and expand over here. Hope it's still possible, but then I think we're better off with the Acolyte. And we'll get two levels and then we'll see where it goes. Uh, we could actually spend some... Maybe for the second level, if I remember it. Right, and then in Beheaded. A Swordsman has been completed. Very nice, that's another Vasset army. And what else? We have six specialists in here. One full elder specialist there. So, what could we do? We could get another poet, or we could go with a scribe. And since they upgrade so fast, I'll power through the scribe here. Does seem like a good plan. Produce even more ridiculous amounts of... Yes, because in two years we're going to be legendary here anyway. And then it, we want to get higher, but I mean, from legendary up, it's really a far journey. So we'll go for the civics points and just try and get make use of all these citizens we have. Okay, now we have a Kushite cavalry. <laughs> I can't get over it, guys, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, I want to just give you combat. We have a swordsman here that could immediately get promoted. Um, extra from urban. We'll go with focus. They need to be moved around as well, but... Ah, yes, the trusty chariot. We need to be on the front lines. Uh, what do we have here? We have some archers. We need some flanking capabilities, so maybe around here. And then you can just hang out. A new pikeman. <clears throat> you certainly need to step up here and get promoted. Well, strike seems good. Onigar is now... Can now go to sentry mode. And you guys also need a promotion. Combat 3 seems good. I have 11.2 combat strength. I'd say there are some serious contenders. 
another fresh swordsman. Um, we also want to fill... But I guess Janet can be the one producing military for these down here, because we are seriously building up Janet as a military production site. So we'll bring our footman up here. There you go. And then we have a new Oniger. No, we have not a new Oniger, but uh, we need to promote you. Focus is fine, and then hopefully we can just have you idle here. Okay, now we have 28 points still. Uh, what do we do with 28 points? Um, let's see, we have a new... Oops, here. We have a new... King of Carthage. You are influenced, but somehow you hate us, because why? He's a schemer? And because we're strong, okay. Okay, so finally they're weaker than us. Um, is it worth it to... I don't think it's worth it to actually influence Syria. With him, it's also not... With him, we already did it, right? Oh no, we could do that more. Not sure. We'll secure ourselves a peaceful relationship with Carthage. <coughs> the ambassador can now go on trade missions with... Uh, So we go with Carthage. I mean, that is likely to be more profitable. Even though it doesn't really matter, does it? Yeah, we'll try and use it in Babylon. As a, as a way of securing favor. Right, so we still have 20 orders. Um, I'm not going to send more food and stuff there. They, they don't like us too much, and I'm not going to try and pimp them with food. It's it's a bit ridiculous, because yeah, it, it just doesn't give enough opinion, I feel. It's a little bit weird that you're able to do that. So I guess we're going to just end the turn with 20 orders. I mean, there's nothing really I want to do. Um, we could upgrade some archers, though. That's a thing we could do. Um, let's see... You are regular archers. You get upgraded. Mm hmm. Hmm. Don't have too many training points. Yeah. Well, I guess we'll just end the turn with that many orders. There's worse things that could happen. So next turn we can uh, start a wonder in Beheaded, finally. And uh, secure ourselves two more victory points, potentially. If nobody beats us to it. Which I don't think anybody will, because Greece and Assyria are now going to beat each other up. And likely Carthage and Babylon as well. And we're just laughing fifth wheel on the wagon actually <laughs> which is just great uh, we convert to paganism okay and we reduce discontent in Tamiat also pretty good center of learning the Zoroastrianism Zoroastrian community of Persaptu has been coming together as a local library examining ancient works and discussing them in the light of the teachings the library has become an important center of learning for Zoroastrianism and Persaptu as a whole they should continue to discuss and learn Guinness philosopher. They should hold public seminars. Or we could spread this to Jadu, which I don't want. Um, we'll get a philosopher. Sporting chances. With the increased recognition of the city of uh, Iyu Shenzhen as a center of culture, there has been a movement from the elders to host a festival of archery. Decree was swiftly issued, starting in Yushenshen. No other sport shall be practiced. 
Okay, so I think we read that already. Um, it doesn't really matter, because we're never going to really go with wrestling. Um, it doesn't matter, because we're never going to really build military here. That's what Janet is for, sadly. But uh, yeah, you can't control where these events go. Okay, so now we have our last settler. The final settler. And we have the city here, the city here. Yes, we'll send you down there. Um, we need to scout a little, but for now we'll just bring you here and maybe scout this a little. Okay, and then run over here. We'll see. Oh, there's the Thrakens. Hey, their last settlement probably. Uh, we could go and uh, finish them off, but I don't think it's too important. Okay, so. Why is beheaded not... Ah, next year. Darn it. Next year. Okay, so we have one mine. We'll just get a second one then, I guess. It's okay. Ah, darn it. I thought we could finally build the wonder there. Um, bum, pa, dum, pum, 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 pum. Uh, we want to grow you rather fast. And we want to grow in this direction. So the question is... We'll just hug the coastline here with hamlets and yeah, we'll build a hamlet and then here an Odeon. Hopefully that'll work out. Kanesh. Um, you have a range. Very good. We'll build another range here. We certainly want production of military. Um, and then we have a couple of workers still in... Oh, in Kanesh. Okay, so we connected you. You are a Basset worker. Um, we have one here, we have one there. So we'll send one over here. Actually, we'll send you here to build a road connection there first. So we can continue here. Okay, so how to do with the hamlets? Probably the same logic. We'll go here, start out with a hamlet. Or do we build it on the hill here? It'll get us a little bit extra cash. Where's the hamlet? Hamlet, hamlet, there we go. A little bit extra cash. No, it's not really worth it. Um, for 10 extra cash. I mean, it's cute and all, but we're going to connect to the road anyway, so it's whatever. Uh, this gives us more tiles and just more flexibility. And then I'm going to start building culture here. Okay, and here we also need to start with the hamlets. Um, I'll say... Or can we build an Odeon here? Is that possible? Yes, it is. Um, Odeon does need... Yeah, so we'll start one here. Um, it does waste a spot close to the city center, but um, we are not going to build wonders here, most likely, so it's okay. And in Sema Beheaded, we now have a shrine of Isis, nonetheless. Um, and I lost the plot. What was the plan in Sema Beheaded? Jesus. <laughs> Um, yeah, Jesus didn't have anything to do with it, but uh, what was the plan here? We could... We're strong culture now, but we've been strong for a while, so that's no excuse. Um, we have the... both baths... Why did I build that here? So I could build a library here? No. Why could we build a library? I mean, it's here or... Yeah, fine, we'll build it here and then the academy here. All that work for nothing. All right, um, then we have a bit of military. Uh, the Kushites, they need to... Provide. We have a bit of flanking capability here. I guess we'll have a bit of a cavalry. I'm 
division here, so we can flank a little. And now we'll have some swordsmen there, and we're just here, and you will promote you once. I mean, 100 is not... Just a good strike, and then they can fortify here, or just build a nice wall against Babylon. And these swordsmen here. You could actually... forward a little. Maybe over here toward the farm. Just modify there. Mm -hmm. and you could chill on the barracks, that's fine. The Onager has a cheap promotion. That we shall get. Some combat bonus, whatever, do more damage. And then we have another longbowman that we just upgraded. And they're fine in the mountains. I think we... Oh, hang on. Did you have an interesting promotion? You did. 130. Ah, no, fine. You just hang out here. We can do that still when the combat begins. Okay, now we have five cities to go through. Um, But I'm not gonna do that this turn. Maybe we can Nash, because we're just right here. Monica completed. I still don't feel fully comfortable. Um, form 2, maybe? I'm kind of a gardener, get olives. All the acolytes. Okay, we'll start with gardener. And we need some culture here and some... some growth. Okay, now I started. Let's... Uh, actually, we're at the end of the season anyway, so we'll we'll take a little... Five minutes extra, it's okay. I'm a bit pressed for time today, but uh, we can deal with that. What the? Well, this is a little ridiculous if we get that. I'll actually wait for this expansion here, because uh, this is a little, <laughs> a little bit ridiculous. We'll just get the gardener here, I guess. And we have three specialists already. Uh, three, not specialists. Um, three, what do you call it? Uh, citizens but this here is I don't want to eat up all that territory from Chem and Vassad there so we'll start with the garden up here okay um, next is Jadu with a farmer nice so Jadu will now finally have a bit of respectable growth and we'll go with a rancher right away more growth is more better as we all know, and then maybe queue up the master officer. Mm, yeah, make that two keys. There we go. Okay, and Tapu, the new city, has now forum. You need walls as well. Just the basics. And Vasset. What can we do in Vasset? We have now completed the settler, and we have three citizens only, so we could use a bit of growth. Maybe and expand down here. Up here, expansion is pretty much out of the question. We could get um, I guess more tiles here wouldn't hurt. Oh, we'll get one woodcutter here. Wouldn't hurt. Um we'll get some doctor. One, two, three, there we go. Okay, and then we'll see after that. Cool, and then we have 15 orders that I don't know what to do with. Um, yeah, there's some more Fog of War. Let's go uncover Fog of War. That's always a good project. All right, and we'll figure out what to do with the rest of the orders next episode or next season, if my math is correct. Which it isn't always, but I think this is the last episode of the season. I'm having a bit of a whirlwind of recording, thanks to humankind. Um, I think we're at the end of the season, guys. But uh, we'll see each other again next week. And then we're going to push for the final couple of points. Um, that should be doable now. We have strong cities that will become legendary. We have uh, developing cities that will become strong. And we have wonders coming online and we're able to build some. 
So we should be able to push for the 64 points, especially with Greece being at war with the uh, apparently stronger Assyria. So that it really plays into our hand nicely. Anywho, you have a wonderful day. And uh, thank you so much for watching, for the likes, comments and subscriptions. Did I say you have a wonderful day? I think it doesn't hurt to say it twice, right? Until next time, goodbye.